Great putts, great moments. It's on Putt Putt. There it is, good putt. And that will end it finally through seven holes. Wanda wins on the seventh hole Sunday. Come Thursday and Friday, and the rain will come in before it goes to Jim. Gary scraped the brick. Oh! <laughs> Got a little bit of a gift there. Looks like Greg is going for the Z shot. Rail? Rail? Wow! Oh. Excellent putt! I'm running out of good adjectives here. And good evening, everybody. It's Opie Roberts coming to you from Asheboro for the first time in three weeks. We're here for our Tuesday night local. And we've got a pretty decent turnout here. I'm gonna say around 20 to 25 players. We've got a really comfortable evening here in Ashboro. We did have a thunderstorm that ripped through here about an hour and a half ago. It has since stopped and skies are trying to clear out. We're not expecting any rain here during the play here so I'll go ahead and tell you right now the temperature here in Asheville is sitting at 77 degrees with a southwest wind at 5 miles per hour but the humidity is pretty moist it's at 93 percent and that's basically because of the rain we just recently had here All right, so there's your players and the, and the course tonight. Let's present to you our pairings. Okay, so here's your open field. We have 17 players here. Connor Carter is the defending champion. Here's the novices. Wendy Kearns, who won last week. She'll be the first. We have 25 players total. Now it's time for the tournament. Let's get underway. Okay, we are underway with Connor Carter on the tee. And Connor will get a two. And he's paired tonight with Leah Rutledge. Oh, she got a straight kick off that back wheel. Probably will see a lot of those tonight. With the carpet still damp, and now we got a two. All right. I did his work. Let's see if the ball does it. Yes, good putt. Looks like it's, nope, it's gonna hang out. She'll get a two there. All right, and here's our second pairing. On the tee, Dylan Robertson. He's gonna get a two. And his playing partner is Jesse Carter. Okay, 
Jesse's gonna miss it. And that's a par. I'll take it. All right, let's. Oh, Leah just about got the back door shot in off that off that uh, little ridge there behind the hole on three. And Dylan on two. We'll get it there, good cut. And we'll check out four. Connor got a two. And now Leah's on the tee. Uh, she's missed right. She'll get a two. Let's go back to the first hole. Our third twosome. And this is the third. And Rick missed that one left. We'll get that too. Hey, he's paired tonight with Daniel Kearns. Oh, it, that left rail sliding a bit. That's it, and good putt. All right, here is Jesse on three. He'll get the deuce. Good putt there. All right, let's check out Daniel on two. Trying to be the first to go two for two. It will cross over there. He'll get a two. And there's Dylan with his shot on four missing to the right. So he'll get a two there. We'll go up to six. First look at this hole. Leah's tee shot on the way. This is right off the stop side and misses left there. So she'll get her two. All right, we head back to the first hole and we got now pairing number four. And on the two, this is Mike Alley. Oh, get, get off, get off. Uh, he's behind the cheese there, so he'll have to put this too as soon as he spaces it out. It'll be, it'll be, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That way. That way. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In line with the hole. Get in. Oh, nope. Nice try. No, I'll go back. You can just. Yeah. And then pull it out. Pull it out like. Like right here? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Not a good start. All right. I have three for Mike. And now this is David Greger. Crushed it. Get in. Oh, it lipped out. Oh. So, David gets his yeah. two. Went around the hole. All right. All right. Maybe I get my bogey off of two. Here's Daniel on the tee at four. Should go in. Oh, missed right. He'll get a two there. All right, we'll go to two. Oh, oh, almost went over. And it goes. Good putt. Right. Oh, we look like we got a loose team mat on five. <laughs> All right, here's pairing number five. Speaking of five, here is Doug Kearns on the tee. That's going to drop in. Nice putt. So we have two aces on this hole. Both of them belong to a guy named Kearns. <laughs> here is Gary Hunt.
And, ooh. Mm. Well, disaster averted there. I almost doubled back in there. All right, so we're 10 players in. Let's go to three. Mike's tee shot misses. <laughs> Trying to roll back. It's not going to go. Miss on the left side. And we go back to one. Our sixth pairing. And this is Alan Burke. No, he's going to. All right, he's in that same area that Mike Alley was in just a moment ago. Nice two. His partner tonight is Keith Waters. And Keith got it. Good putt. Let's go to four. And Mike's tee shot. This is right. And he'll tap in his two, and we'll check out Doug on the two. Yeah. Oh, actually, we're waiting on... He's waiting on Gary here. Let's go back to two, then. I forgot Doug's in another group. We'll check out Alan Burke on the two. Get in. Nice wow. shot. That's, that's All right. Good. Now we're going to parry number seven. This is going to be a threesome here. We have the net block on the tee. Now, oh, it does go in. Did that go in? Um, yeah, it did. That was very lucky. Yeah, because your ball was over here towards me. Did it hit the thing? It never, no, it just hit the block and just went in. Wow, that was very lucky. Lady luck, hold on. Now on the tee, this is Jimmy Comer. I mean, it's about to go on the right side of the front. Wow. That could work. That could work. Uh, no, oh, that just so missed right. God, how did it miss? That's Keith Waters right there. <laughs> Third player in this pairing is Randy Water. Simpson. Freshly back from Aruba. And there was a streaker at his food line. Little known facts. You like it? I did. Off the block. Oh, no Don Thompson there. All right, now he's putting for his two. That's it. Nice two. All right, let's continue on. Excuse me. There's Gary Hunt on five. Got it. Good putt. And here's Keith on three, going for a two. Get in. Nope. Just didn't hit it enough to get it up. So he'll get a three there. There's Gary on six, lipping out, going for now going for a two. I can zoom up here to 14. Leah's tee shot. Can't see can't see the hole there, but it's maybe a couple of feet from the drop area. She's gonna get a two. Alright, and we head back to one. This is the Final group in the open division. We have Chase Ferguson on the tee. Now Chase did finish tied with Connor last week in the 
tournament, but he lost in sudden death on the after a nine hole playoff. Get in. At least I got around it. I'll take All right, that's a two for Chase. And you'll see there, he's. We've got the uh, guy from NC Family of Three here tonight playing with Chase. This is Gary Ellis. Going to be documenting his tournament here in Asheboro. And that will miss left. He'll tap in his two. All right, now all the, top, all the open players that have teed off, we go to five. We see Keith on the tee. Keith missed right. He'll tap in a par there. And let's look at Jimmy on four. That's missed right. He'll get a two. And let's check out the net on the two. She left her short. That'll be a two. And back over to two. Gary Ellis is by the left wall and he'll get the two there and here's randy simpson on four missing right off the back rail and it drops in all right now we begin the novice division and this is wendy kearns on the tee she won last week with a score of 98 And Wendy taps in her two. Her playing partner for this evening is Danny Jackson. Now Danny's going to get a two there. And we will continue on to hole number 11, our first look at this hole. There's David Gregor with a two. Here's Mike Alley on the tee. Oh, oh, just jumped up on top of the hole. He'll get a two there. Now, right, here's your second pairing of the novice division. This is Monica da Jackson. Get in. Good putt. Good putt. I can't believe it. And she's paired tonight with Kim Miller. Off the cheese, and okay, she's in good position. She'll get a two. All right, and we're going to continue on this next pairing. This is Johnny Brower. Okay, Johnny's going to pick up a deuce there. His playing partner is Joey Davis. Nope. Whoa. That was luck. Oh, the back rail just killed that ball there. He'll get a two. There it is. And now we go back over the four. And here's Chase on the tee. Chase didn't hit it, didn't like the way he hit it. He's going to get a two. All right, 
to check out Wendy on the tee at three. Wendy kind of agonizing on that tee shot. It's going to be short of the cut. She's going to get her two. We head back over to 11. Gary Hunt got a two there. On the tee, this is Doug Kearns. Get in. Good putt there for Doug. To five. Well, there's Gary Ellis. Go straight to the back rail. Good two. Good. Just as I called it. I'm sure you can. All right, we'll check it. There is Chase on the tee. Chase will not get it. And here is the final pairing of the night. This is Jason Miller. Just clip the tip there. So he'll get a two. And this is Javi Sanchez. Is it enough to go? Nope. So there's a two for Javi. That means all the players are on the course. Great way, Tyler. We are going to go to hole number eight for the first time. We've got Randy Simpson's on the tee. He's hit the rail very late. We'll get a two there. Now we go to 18. This is the ever popular table and shoot hole. With the special ruling that your ball on the table is good from this point on. Just like that, he'll get a two. And here is Rick on a two. Pull that one, he's gonna get a two there. And chase on seven. First look at the tree hole. Drops it in. No, it whips out. Hey, he'll get it. All right. We're going to go to 17 for the first time. And look at here, folks. David changed the rail since the last time I was here. I don't know how that hole is playing now. We'll see in a second. All right, he's moved, moved the ball over to six now. All right, now we'll see Mike Alley on the tee. Uh, well, he'll have a long two. And we'll go over to hole seven. Oh, we're gonna hold off from there. We'll, we'll, you know what? Let's 
look at some scores here. The other groups are already in. So you're either at 29, you're at 35. Right now it's, oh, David's got a brand new laptop. Okay. Ah. Okay, here we go. So Connor, Dylan, and Jesse right now have the lead at 29. Rick's at 30 in second. Or in fourth, I should say. And on 18, David's going to get a two. Mike Galley on the tee now. And he'll get a two. There's Wendy's husband, Doug, on 17, getting a par there. Randall showed me that shot. All right, now we'll see Gary Hunt on the tee. Good kick, but it's not gonna turn over, so. He'll get a two, and we'll see Chase on nine for his two. And he'll get it. And let's go to 14. We got Allen Berg. Nice little lip in. Yeah, let's look at Gary Ellis on nine. Sit, oh. sit, sit. Nope, he'll go down for his two. And we'll go to 15 for the first time. 15 labeled the easiest hole here in Ashboro. And Alan Burke just nice smooth putt around that ring and it drops in dead center. Here's Keith on the tee. God. No, he did not just, hold the line. He pushed it. So he's against the ring. He, he can push it out and go for his two. Let's go to 12. Our, it, our famous rat hole. Andy Simpson made it off the team mat. And now here is Jimmy Comer. Also gets it. <laughs> and Vanette pulled her tee shot. She's going to have to hit her two putt there into the hole there at the top. And here's Leah on three. That's it. Nice shot. All right. We'll look at 13 for the first time. This is that. This is the tee hole. On the tee, Randy Simpson. And got a bad kick off that right rail. And he'll get his two. Let's go to 10. Gary's tee shot hit the wrong part of that angle there. So he'll putt for his two. Good putt there. There's Comer's shot on 13. It's in. Comer, you about 13 under, ain't you? It's not too bad. Not with Randy putting first. Hmm? Not with Randy putting first. <laughs> <laughs> and Vanette on 13. She missed it. Short of the cup. She'll get her two. All right, let's look at 11. Chase on the tee. Get up. It will go in. Good putt. And there's Dylan on three, going for a two. two. Mm -hmm. 
just to go. Here's the tee shot of Vanette on 14. It will miss right. Should get her two there. Let's go to six. Leah caught the right lip. She'll have her two there. And we'll check out Connor on the tee. And Connor's missed right, and he'll get his two. All right, let's go to four. We have Jesse on the tee. And off the block, missing right. All right, he gets his two. And we'll get some more scores in the clubhouse. So be the first 12 players in. And well, we got all right. We got Doug in at 26. So now the lead is three over four players. And added stat list would be Gary Hunt. He shot 29. So there's four 29s right now. All right, let's go. All right, let's go to one. David Spann. Put, put his two in. And Mike Alley's on the tee. Just got past the tip. And he got it. So Alley got an ace there. Let's go to. Let's go over here to eight. Check out Javi Sanchez on the tee. Okay, Javi just missed right, and Javi will pick up a deuce there. We now go to 16. This is our first look at the trapezoid hole. Vanette's tee shot. That's it. No, it scooted past the hole there. All right, now Jimmy Comer. Okay, Jimmy got a good putt. We'll see Randy Simpson on the tee. That missed it high and lipped. He gets a two. Let's go to seven. Dylan will miss left. Gets a two there to 17. Looks like Homer all. Oh. Get the two. And Jesse on a T of eight. That's Miss Wright, and he'll get his two. And checking out the net now at 17. Get, nope, caught the lip. Oh, yeah. And it rolled back over to her left, so she'll get her two. We are going to go to four. Mike Alley will be on the tee. That's left, and Mike will get a two. All right, it's 18. I haven't seen anybody make it yet. And 
Homer gets her gets his two. Here's Annette on the tee. Get in. Okay, she gets her two. And here's Rick on the tee at seven. Enough speed. Get, get off. Oh, just didn't get to the cup. So Rick will putt for his two. Let's check out Randy Simpson on the tee at 18. And that missed right. So he'll come to and we'll go to back to seven with Daniel Kearns on the tee. Ah, oh, he's going to get a huge kick and missing way left. And he'll putt for his two. And let's go to five. Well, let's do five and three. There's Allie on five, Doug on three. Allie missed left. Doug also missed his left. So Allie gets his two. Doug should get his two. Doug is currently the first round leader at 26. There's five players yet to report in the clubhouse. Two of them are just getting on 16. We'll have them coming in momentarily. And we see Gary Hunt on the tee. He was one of those four players at 29. He's short of the cup. We're going to get a six as well. Gary got his two. D David's tee shot off the block and comes up short. And he'll tap in that four incher for par. And now we'll see Doug on four. That's missed right. He'll putt for his two. All right, let's. I can see Jesse's on 10, got an ace there. All right, we are heading to 17. We have Chase on the tee. No, he is just off the edge. It lined up, and but not enough speed. Not enough speed, and it turned back to his left, so he'll get a two. All right, now the exchange of the camera, and Gary will be on the tee. Check out. Everybody can check out his YouTube channel at NC Family of Three. He, he just uploaded a new video today. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, he's going to putt for two. He had the line. So it was a little bit easier in my one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep, good, good putt. Two. Good putt. Let's go to eight. We've got David on the tee. Oh, he... Wow, he just he's just fortunate that he just clipped that gate there. Another one of the Randall Smith shots we just witnessed there. Alright, there's a two. Here's Mike Alley. Ball hopped off the carpet there, and he's gonna miss his to the right. We go to 18, Chase is on the tee. He'll get it. Nice putt. I'll get a free game. <laughs> All right, let's go to eight. And Gary's going to get a kick off that rail missing left. 
now here's Gary on 18. All right, Gary, we'll pick that up for his two. Hmm? You don't have to hit him. It's, oh, all putts on the table are good. So, so that's a two for you. Okay. All right, so the Oakland division is now done with the first round. And now we'll go over here to 17. Looking at Danny Jackson coming for his two. And we'll see Wendy on the tee. You remember Wendy and her infamous ace here on this hole a few weeks ago. Okay, Wendy will get a two. Here's her husband on eight. His tee shot will not go. This is right. All right, so let's head back now to six. We got Alan Burke on the tee. And yo, got it. Good putt. We go to four. Jimmy Comer on the tee. Yeah, just leave it. Yeah, that's it. Nope, that's missed left. And let's go to the score sheet. So currently, your first round leader is Doug Kearns at 26, and he is up two strokes over Jimmy Comer and Chase Ferguson. They each shot 28. And then there's that slew of 29s in a tie for fourth. All right. Here is Randy Simpson on the tee at four. Miss left, and he'll get a two. Let's go to nine. There is the first round leader, Doug Kearns. Get in. Nice shot. Thank you. All right. Doug playing serious here. We go to 10. And David's not going to get it. Flipped out there. And there's Leah lifting out 14. Well, missing 14. She didn't lift it. She got her two. Dylan on 13, his two shot. Skims past that lip there. So he'll get a two and we'll check out Jesse's two shot. And Jesse, get in, good putt. We go to 15. Bobby Sanchez, you know, he hit, pushed it a little bit, got into the center of that ring, and once you hit the center area, beyond that to the right, the ball's going to die pretty much. So, Javi got a two. We'll check out Jason Miller on the tee. Yeah, that's about where you want to hit the ball. And he gets the ace there. We will check out Alan Burke on nine. Oh, he's going left, and Alan will putt for two. We go to, well, let's go to 17. Hang on, hang tight, folks. We got What happened? It hit the thing and went out. Okay. What happens here? Okay, you take the ball. Where it went out, it would be under the table. Right. Okay, then you got to pull it back on, um, from here. So you get a car, you get a scorecard length. Well, not, I'm sorry, a club length, which will put you here. All right? Okay. Also, 
because you went out of bounds, it's a stroke penalty. So okay. now this is for three. Okay. All right. So that's a five. Well, well, no, that no. What you put there from there was three. It didn't get up, so you went back there. That was for four. Four, right? Okay, four. right. But yeah. you're on the table. That's for five. So, so that's. Okay. Yeah. Well, I shouldn't have put it then if it was going to be five. <laughs> well, you still had to put the four though. That's the thing. If it got in the hole, it'd be a four. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I see what you're saying. Right, right, right. But when she went out, it's the same as jumping the rail. What she did there, so, you know, that's a stroke penalty, putting it back in play. Okay. Yeah, that's Johnny, who's going to get a two there. And okay, Joey Davis. All right, he'll get a two. All right, here's Hobby on 17. Get in. Oh. <laughs> nice run at it. Ja Hobby gets a two. All right, now on the tee is Jason Miller. And he'll get us too. Let's get eight. All right, but that will get her two. Here's Gary Ellis on seven, going for his two. Got it there. We head to 18. Javi Sanchez on the tee. Oh, almost jumped over the table. And Hobby gets a two. Back to seven. Chase on the tee. That's missed left. Chase will putt for his two. And back to 18. This is the end of the first round. Jason's tee shot will come up short. That's a par. We'll head to 17. Connor Carter got the ace there. All right. We'll head over to... We need to track down this. We need to track down a leader here. He's well. He's waiting on 14. So let's go to nine. Randy Simpson for his two. All right, he got it there. Here's Bennett on the tee. And that got a good putt. We got Danny Jackson here on six for his two. And this will be the tee shot of Wendy Kearns. And she'll putt for her two. Doug's on 14 for his two. Got it. And there's Gary Airless on nine. He's putting for a two. Uh, oh, it's going to be a three. Daniel Kearns on the tee at 16. It's in. Nice shot. On the tee with Ben. And 
And Rick also got a good putt. <clears throat> and here's Chase on nine. He's two shot. Nope, that's going left. And Mike Alley with his ace on 15. <laughs> we'll see. Doug now on the team. Oh, slow down. Got it. Good putt. And we'll, we'll check out Gary Hunt. Okay, you'll see another shot that people play. He's going to bank it off that right rail. Into the ring. Should go. And it will go. Good putt. We go now to 16. That will get it. go in. Good putt. Okay. Danny Jackson getting a three there. Here we go on 18. Daniel Kearns on the tee. We'll get it. Good putt. All right. We'll head to the scoreboard. Got to do some following here for these leaders here. All right, so we have a 58 by Connor, and Dylan and Jesse are at 59 right now. All right, let's go back out to the course. And on the tee at 17, this is Gary Hunt. Get in for Gary. Nice. Oh! That was a good putt. I, I don't care what anybody says. Man, there's Keith on 16. Showing a bit of frustration there that his putt left down the front part of the cup. All right, Keith got his two. There's Doug with an ace on. 18 there, and there's Connor starting his final round with a deuce. Ooh, now Leah Rutledge. If she won't get it there. All right, we have Gary for his two on 18. He'll go. Good save. <laughs> to 17. All right, I'm going to track the car. He did make two. Anyway, Gary, I mean, Allen will get a two there. Here's Keith on the team. Keith won't get it either. We go to three. And Connor makes it there. Here. here we go. Duck turning the second 26 tonight. And now he's up by six on Connor and also on Rick Bear. Just uh, Doug's at six, uh, 52, Rick's at 58, so is Connor. 
Connor is two under after three. Jesse just got the tee shot on two. He's one under for his third round. And here's Dylan. That's in. Good fight. And Connor got a two there on four. We'll see Lee on the tee. He is going to miss hers to the right. We go over the three. And Jesse on the tee. He got it. Good putt. All right, Jason Miller will not get the tee shot on five. Here's Bill on the tee. He'll get it. Good shot. All right, we got to get the novice scores. I have not. Folks, you're not missing anything. From what I could see, Danny Jackson, 33. Wendy, 34. All right, so we'll get a complete score rundown in a moment here. Connor's on five. Misses, and he's going to get his two. Dylan missed there on four. So Dylan is two under. So is Jesse. There's Rick to get his final round again. He was at 58. Currently putting him at six back of the lead. We understand we see a lot of patience in here. Got it. He did get it. So he starts one under for the round. And we will go now to five. Jesse's tee shot misses left. And it stops there. He'll get a two. And the two. That's also in for Rick, so he's two under to start his final round. And here is Dylan on six. I'm oh, sorry, Connor on six. He got the whip. And he's going for two. Dylan's going to get a two here on five to stay two under on his round. Connor got that two. He stays at four. Oh, he stays at two under. So Connor's two under, Jesse's two under, Dylan's two under, Rick is two under, heading to hole three. And it's going to be several more minutes before Doug gets on the tee. And don't forget Chase is still in play. No, Rick's not going to get it. So he should get his par. There's seven. There's Kimes' tee shot. That's left, and he's going to do his two. We're going to 18. Here's Chase to close round number two. 
Dylan got the tee shot on six. He's three under. Jesse also got it. He's three under. Chase this left. He'll fin he'll finish the round with the two. And Rick got the tee shot on four, putting him three under. All right to eight. Gonna get a two, and now Connor on the tee. And Connor gets it. He's going to three under. Rick got a deuce on five, so he stays three under. Dylan's tee shot on seven. It goes in. Last rolled it in, so he'll get. He'll go to four under now on the round. Doug is now on the tee at one. Let's, you know, let's go over there now. And Doug can't. We'll just have to see how he reacts here. Got it. He got it. So, so he starts one under. Let's go to six. No, Rick's going left. Rick will get his two. He'll stay at three under on his final round. All right, so let's get a let's get a rundown right now. We've got Connor sitting at three under after eight. Dylan's four under after seven. Jesse's three under after seven. Rick's three under after six. And we will go to them in a little bit. Let's go to one. Very saved that goose put a moment ago, uh, back in the first round. Off the block. No, doesn't go, so he'll get a two. Or three, excuse me. Okay, Connor's at the back rail on nine. All right. <laughs> All right, Chase is at 57, so he's five off the pace. Connor got the two. Doug got the ace on two. And here is Dylan on eight. Misses to his right and to seven. Rick's tee shot will miss right. And he'll get his two putt there. And let's go back to Jesse off eight. Won't get it there. And Doug, an, another ace there on three. And Gary will get the ace on three. And there's Connor acing 10. He's now four under. And look at Daniel on seven. Dylan got the ace on nine, putting him at five under. All right, there's Doug on four. He looked out. All over this hole, but in. He's over there at 482. Doug got it there, so. I saw that girl on the right side.
All right. Here, let's go now to Now you hit it. You hit through the. <laughs> we got eight. Hey, Rick got that one, so he goes to four under. And here's Daniel on the two. He's going to get it there. Good putt. So let's do a little rundown here. Let's go to here's Doug on six. Sure do. Got it. And he's four for six on the round. So let's do the rundown here. There's Connor. He's four after ten. Dylan five after nine. Jesse, four after nine. Now Dylan's five after ten. Here's Rick on nine. He's four after eight. Doug's four after six. Chase yet to tee off. Nope, Rick missed right. Let's go to ten. And nope, he'll miss. Doug on seven, no. He'll, got the bottom lip, he'll get a two. All right, he'll get it. So he stays at 400. Connor's going for a two on, on 11. That's good, so. Connor's at 90. Uh, so is Dylan. Jesse's at 91. Rick's at 90. Doug is a 4, 52. He's 86. No, I'm sorry. He's 80. He's 40, He's 84 right now. And Chase has yet to start his final round. But Connor made 12, and that puts him at 89. Well, Doug is Doug's on fight. Well, no, he missed. So he's he's gonna keep his two there, putting him at 84 still. David Gregor there missed the left on nine. And we go to 11. Dylan missed there. All right, we are going back to one. Chase starting his final round. He was five back in the lead. He's currently nine back in the on the score sheet. Dylan got his two on eleven. And Chase got the ace there on one. There's uh there's uh Jesse there on eleven, missing there. And Rick got 10. He's going to 5 under. No, I lagged it. I just didn't want to take 3. That's first. Yeah. I think Connor made 13. If so, he's 7 under. Easy. All right, here's Chase on 2. It's going to rock in and it's going to cross over. So he's going to get a two there. Here's Jesse on 12 with his ace. 
the T and eleven Vic Mayor. Back door short of the cup. We'll go to three. That's a move. Go to three in a moment. Actually, we'll yeah, we'll go there now. And Gary, I'm sorry, Gary's going to get a two there. And let's go to twelve. Rick got it. Good putt. On the T at 10, our leader, Doug Kearns. Get in. Oh, it's short. All right, so Doug gets a two. And we had the four. Chase on the tee with the score of 200 right now after three. Make that three under after four. Let's go to 11. David's going to get a two. Here's Dylan on 14, missing right. Rick's on the tee at 13. That is lipped off the left side. Daniel, I mean Doug, got the tee shot 11. Five under for him now, which puts him at 83. All right, there's key for two on nine there. And I'll see Alan Burke on a tee. It will be short. So Doug gets it. I'm sorry, Alan gets it two. Let's go to 12. So Daniel, I'm sorry, Doug Kearns is right now is at 83. He chose his 300 after five. He would be right now at 90, but he's got a lot of holes left. Now here is Doug on the tee at 12. No, missed the left whip. And he'll go for two. Should make it up top. All right, now we go to six. Chase left the uh, tee shot short off the octagon. I'm just letting the line for the line. Why does it go in? Why does it come in with it? All right, let's look at Gary Ellis on the tee. You got it, good putt. Over the 14. <laughs> Rick the best left, and he's going to get a two putt there. We'll check out a book on ten. Get in, beauty, nice shot. And Rick for his two there, he'll get it. On uh, thirteen. Gary's going to get a three. And Doug will be on the tee. And he's going to...
Doug will get it. Nice putt. And chase on seven. Nope, that's right. All right, so that's a par. All right, coming. All right, here is Doug on 14. He left it short. So he stays at six. Chase got the deuce on seven. Connor is finished. Let's see what their scores come out to be here. I am watching these other two, these other groups trying to close it out here. So, oops. all right, so Connor right now sits at 86. Don't think that's going to hold because Doug's at 82. See Jesse on the tee here at 18. That's a par. Hey, here is Doug on 15. All right, that's in. Doug is drawing closer to his first ever win here in Ashbar. Chase on eight. Not gonna go. All right, so he stays at three under. Randy on nine, gonna miss left. Hey, we'll see David on 16. No, he'll miss it on the low side. We'll see my galley on the tee. And that's in good putt. Finally. I knew when it came off the road. All right, now Doug. Be good. No, this is. All right. With this one, correct? Yes. Straight off, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Doug got a two. Doug, that's a disqualification that you don't know which way to move it out from the rail. <laughs> I was making sure. <laughs> How you doing? Let me see. Oh, he missed there. So five, six, seven, eight. Okay. All right, Doug is actually at 80, so I did miss it. He's, well, I wasn't paying attention. There's David on 17 for his two. We go to nine. All right, Chase goes to four under. Doug on 17, not going to get it. He's going to get it too. Here's Gary Ellis on nine. Missing that. Okay, well, all three rounds, he didn't get it up that plateau. So, we are going to check out the scores after... Two rounds in the novice division.
Oh. Oops, quickly. So there is two eighty sixes, Connor and Rick. All right, Doug's getting ready to go on eighteen. Here he is right now. This is he makes it. If he makes it, he shoots seventy nine. Twenty nine thirty, I think, is what we hit. Oh, just missed, but. This is a good tournament for Doug. Finishes at 80 by my count. And that means Chase is four under. He's at 89. Oh, that means he's got an ace out to win. Or actually go to the playoff. Chase got it, so. What are you? Uh, five. I see him. You got to ace out the tie. I'm trying to put pressure on you. All right, on 12. Jimmy's going to go for a two. Oh. Nope. Don't fill me on this one. I wow. get nervous on this. And you 14, and four, not, and you, 14 in the high point. I hate them both. <laughs> I get nervous. You gotta get that out of your system. I know. You gotta, let's go to six. I haven't seen Joey Davis there. Oh, he missed a deuce. All right, so there's a two. Over to nine. Oh, good too. All right. And see if Monica. Whoops. Oh, let's go to eleven. It's all right. Chase is still on life support. Randy on 13 makes this is there to his left. So he'll get it too. Well, all right, we're gonna we're gonna look at the novice scores. I've been neglecting to do that. Excuse me, Daniel, can I we've got a 59 by Jason Miller. Up a bunch over Danny Jackson. It's 10 back at 69. All right. Chase is now on the tee at 12. Okay, Chase is still in. Putting him at seven under on the round. <laughs> There's Hobby going for two on six. All right, so Chase is sitting at 86 with six to go. Let's go to 14. And Randy got it. Good play. Let's go to Jason on seven. Obviously going to win this novice division yet again. And all likelihood, he's going to be promoting himself to the uh, open division next week. Good putt, Jason. All right, we'll check out Jimmy on 14. Nope, that's right. Going for a two. All right, we're back back to Chase on 13 now. That is not going to go. 
so Chase taps into Deuce. Now he's going. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time ever in Ashboro, this man has won the Open Division. Unbelievable. Well, you played real well. Now I got to get some of uh, describe some of your action from today. How 26 and 26 is real strong. Shot a freaking 80, man. Can you believe that? <laughs> <laughs> three for hole 13, I'm 0 for 3 on. <laughs> well, there's lots of holes. He was like 3 for 3 on. I mean, what 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 was going through your mind today? I mean, you you like you were in the zone. I mean, you played pretty well, you know, since you've come up here and played. So, What's the best I've ever played? The best I've ever done, I shot an 88 one time. Right, yeah. So I got an 80 tonight. So. Good, well, that's... That's a solid score, no matter how you look at it. So. It is to me. I'll yeah. probably never touch it again. Well, hey, 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 it'll happen. You, you, I mean, Chase can shoot in the 70s like that, so can it, you know. <laughs> yeah, but Chase is really, really good. Well, you, you know, you have good nights, you have bad nights. Yeah. It just clicked tonight. I had no bogeys for the first time ever. No, that's that's a that's a positive thing right there. You know, you, you, know, you kind of just held your held yourself in check and just let it, let it uh, flow through, so. It was just a good night. Yes, sir. All right. Well, congratulations. Thanks, first, buddy. First, I appreciate it. Yes, you. sir. First win in Ashboro for Mr. Kearns here. All right. Let's go to... Sixteen. Range, range is T shot. Misses there. All right, we'll see Vanette on the tee. And Vanette's gonna get it too, so Jimmy on the tee now. Jimmy's not going to get it. Got to kick off that back rail. And there's a two for Jimmy. All right. Well, look at Chase on the tee. Now, he's made, he's made 14 and 15 since uh, he missed 13. That's, nope. All right. He'll get a two. Chase is solidly in second right now. Let's go to nine. And Hobby's going to miss it left. All right, well, we'll get Jason Miller. Good putt for Jason. And here's Comer on 17. This left, and will not turn back over. He'll get his two. We'll see Chase on the tee now. And Chase will miss left. He'll give a two there. All right, there's Jason Mill about to play hole 10. We're going to go to the novices as soon as all the pro, uh, open, open players are done. Jason appears to be your winner here in that novice division. There's Gary Ellis on 17. He's going to get a two there. There's Danny on 16. That is going to be short of the cup. All right, Wendy on the tee.
Hey, good putt there for Wendy. Now I'm going to make you even a prouder wife. <laughs> Doug has won. Oh, he has won? Yes, he has. Oh, great. Mm -hmm. That's great. It's his first win, I Yeah, think. first ever, yeah. Mm -hmm. right. First ever in this division. Yeah, he, he was clicking all night. He was, he, he, yeah. Okay. All right, so Jimmy Comer there is on 18, getting a two. And we're going to check out Chase on 18. It's a fluke, I'm telling you. It's it is, fluke. ain't it? <laughs> It will miss left, and Chase will finish second, regardless, at 84, and Gary Ellis now. Missed left there. He'll get a two, and we are going to head to the... We're gonna head to the score sheet here. I want to get the I want to get all of the open players in before David starts Let's see. taking his funds. 92, 98. That's what I got. What That's about uh, what did Rick shoot then? I cannot read it. Rick finished at 86. Good tournament. Doug is That's gonna Doug is your winner at 80. Chase will be second at 84. Connor and Rick tied for third at 86. <laughs> There's an 88, 90. Oh, come on. What you got? 2735. 27. All right, here's your. Here's your final tally here. Doug at 80 wins for the first time ever in Ashboro. He wins by four over Chase, who shot 84. Connor and, uh, excuse me, Connor and Rick tied for third at 86. And recap, it's still here in the novices right quick. Jason Bill is going to end up winning. He's at 59 right now for two. All right, so let's... Let's uh let's head back here now. Watch the watch these uh final few team players here. And this is Kim Miller on fourteen. Ooh, whipped out. <laughs> Okay, Cam's going to at least get a three. Or a four. All right, she'll get that, and now we'll stay on this hole. This is her dad, Johnny Brower. It's going left. He's party for two. Let's go back to 12. Oh, Jason. Oh, he almost. Oh, it's rolling back down. That might be the best thing. He caught the right lip, almost made the hole up top. Now he's putting for two. going all right and here's this is joy davis this is for two on 14. nope this news there all right we go to we go to 16.
And Kim, oh, craned it. Good putt. Right, let's look at <clears throat> Monica Jackson on the tree. And she got it too. Good putt. All right, you go to 15. We see Joey Davis on the tee. Good putt for Joey. Nice shot. Hey, Kim got the tee shot on 17. Got a nice roll down that ramp. She's going for two. And this is Johnny Barrow on 16. Nope. Johnny's going to get a two. Okay, we'll see Joey Davis. Good putt. Good putt. All right, there's Javi on 14. He's putting for two off the T map. Got a three there. We go to 18. Kim's going to get a two there. Monica gonna get herself a two to end her tournament. And we've got Johnny for his two on 17. All right, we go to 16. Here's Jason Miller going. Are gonna, like I said, win this tournament? And he got it. First place. There you heard David Gregor announcing the champion tonight in the open division. And Javi lipped, and he'll get us to Chase Ferguson, second place with 84. Now on the T18, Johnny Brower. Thanks for that All right, Johnny will get a two. We see Joey Davis on the team. And that's a two for Joey. And this leaves one group left. Javi Sanchez on 17. That ball went airborne, one hop over the back rail and Javi's putting for three mm. oh he's got a five so we go now to 18 and This will complete our action, and, and I'll go ahead and tell everybody watching 
tied for third place is Connor Carter and Greg Mary. I will be at High Point on Thursday night on course one at 7.30. I'm still looking to going to Hickory this coming Friday at 7 on course one. Ah, uh, Javi's going to close with a two. Okay, so that will complete our action for tonight. All right, let's get our scores from all the players tonight. All right, so let's congratulate, let's congratulate Jason Miller again with his win there in the novice division. I don't even know where he shot. Thank you, sir. All right. You're welcome. What, what did you shoot? Uh, last round. Hey, get well, him out of that uh, league. Get him out. Yeah. Welcome to open. <laughs> well, I'm not ready yet. Yeah, you are. Nobody. Everybody's not ready. <laughs> okay, so... All right, so David's still trying to... Jason shot, what, what 20, 28, is that right? 25. 25. So that was 84, right? Yes, 84. Well, that could have been tied, that could have been tied for second. <laughs> all right. Well, let's take a look at all the final scores. All right, so... Here are your final scores. Let's, let's go to the open division. Doug Kearns with a solid night bogey free tournament. Wins by four strokes with a final score of 80. Chase Ferguson second at 84 and tied to third. Fire Carter, Carter and Rick Baird at 86. Down in the novices, it's Jason Miller. Final round 25 just blew the competition away. Winning with a score of 84 and in second, tied for second will win because of Danny Jackson at 104. Alright, so there you have it. And that means we are going to wrap it up here in High Point. I'm sorry, Nashburn, excuse me. We're going to be in High Point Thursday night at 7.30 on course number one. All right, and so for all of us here in Ashboro, this is Opie Roberts. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you later. Good night, everybody.